Oh, hey, good morning. You know, I've been down here for a week and a bit. Got a week and a bit to go. And when I came down, I thought it'd be my own personal lockdown. When the uh, the whole lockdown thing started, of course, I was I was working. Well, I wasn't working every single day because we lost a lot of the work that we had through this COVID thing. Rode my bike to work and back. That was all. During the lockdown period, which was four or five weeks, a baby born, my daughter's third child, and then they dropped it down to level three. I don't know how it works in other countries, but the government here has um, four levels in this COVID alert thing, and we dropped down to level three, and in level three they said that if you were in a part of the country that wasn't home, you could go home. So I came home, I was a bit sneaky, got on the bike and I came down here to see my new grandchild and for Mrs V's birthday. And I hadn't seen her for two months because I was due to come down just as the lockdown thing happened. Now we've gone from level from level 4 down to level 3, it's when I snuck down here. We're now on level 2, have been for a week or so. In level 2 they still want us to restrict uh, gatherings and a lot of bars and things are open but with restriction we can move around the country and so that's why i'm down here and i've taken leave from work and i had three weeks off and i thought well come down here could do all sorts and yeah i've been been busy been doing lots of work because we've got this huge garden here that we're trying to get to know and trying to uh, kind of do something with this is our woodshed getting cold so been moving firewood from here around onto one of the porches for Mrs V during during the winter when I'm not here. And the girls are with me so there's no motorbike here because I came down with the van. But come and have a look out the back. Autumn colours at the moment. There's the firewood I've been stacking up and I've been attacking this section of the garden trying to get some semblance of order out of it. And it's a big job but we'll get there. And one of the things I was going to do, oh, many things I was going to do, I was going to have a haircut. That was going to be the first thing I did. When lockdown started, I said to myself, I'm not going to have a haircut until this is all over. Well, it's pretty much all over. Time for a haircut. Um, my oldest son's third child was born here in this house during lockdown. So we've got two lockdown babies have joined our family. Anyway, now it's time to go and have a haircut. Come on in. Here we've got all the necessaries. Let's um, see what we can do with it. Let's um, get rid of some of this here. And we've uh, need a little bit of lubrication. That's what she said. I'll get rid of that out. Or oh, she, she'll give me a clip around the ears. Here we go. Get some of that moving along. We're gonna go for a number three. Came out some of the cooties. Alright. Let's get rid of this. Alright, I normally do it with that.
Thanks for watching. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> I've confessed to the world that I don't really do it all by myself. <laughs> I think I did. I think I used to go to two. That'll do for a start. I don't want to shock the world too much, you know. Throw that in thinner, isn't it? Like a lot thinner on the top. Yeah. It's teaching me to give my brother grief about it. <laughs> he got quite ashamed of too. <laughs> yeah. Well, you had the lockdown baby, now I'm having the lockdown haircut. <laughs> Yeah, same thing pretty much. <laughs> what was that? Same thing pretty much. Pretty much, yeah. Same experience. We're all in this together. Give me extension cord there. Say what? Give me extension cord. For what? So I can travel up that one part. Um, For what? To charge my laptop when I'm studying. I can barely hear you, something better here with that on. To charge my laptop when I'm studying. Yes, there is somewhere. Where? In the bedroom. And uh, old shopping bag against the wall towards the corner, I think. Which corner? That corner.